Hello everyone, Dr. Kaysen coming to you with the Drugless Doctors from Westlake and I'm really excited to share with you about thermography and we've been doing this for several years now and one of my favorite things is when we initially start doing thermography is we do an initial baseline scan and then after that, after you have your first two scans, you get your baseline and then your next scan pending the results is in a year from now. And what's really, really marvelous is many of you ladies and as early as 25, you can start doing this thermography with this, is we see how your patterns improve from your breast tissue in a year from doing a couple items. So you might be thinking, okay, Dr. Kaysen, so what's thermography? How do you do it? And what exactly are you seeing? And thermography, it's a temperature evaluation of the breast tissue. What I love about it, no squishing, no radiation, and no compression. So a lot of you ladies, after your appointment, you go, Dr. Kaysen, that was it? That was so easy. And it really is easy. It only takes a couple moments for you to do. There are some specific guidelines, which you can look at our website, and I have videos, the research, it does not replace a mammogram, but it's a temperature evaluation of function because I know many of you, you might have a history of breast cancer yourself, or you might have a grandma, an aunt, a sister that has maybe had breast cancer, or even in your mind, you're thinking proactively that you wanna work on preventing breast cancer. So what we're seeing in these scans, when a woman puts her arms up like this and I do all those pictures, you could have inflammation or redness underneath your armpits from our experience of looking at different patterns you could have lymph congestion i have a woman right now she was a librarian and she was stocking books and she kept thinking she was having shoulder challenges and many of you you might have shoulder challenges but for this woman when we did her thermography she put her arms up like this and we saw redness underneath her armpits. So we started using some lymphatic support in our practice. And when we did her follow-up scan a year later, and I sat down with her and I was talking to her about her history, and guess what? She goes like this, Dr. Kaysen, look at me. I can move my arm up and down. And I said, isn't that incredible? She said, it was that lymphatic drainage that I've been taking. And we saw how her images improved. So you might have some lymph congestion in your body. With looking at the breast tissue here overall, you might have dense breast tissue or even fibrous tissue, whether from having children, hormonal imbalance, and there are simple things you can do nutritionally that we have found from our experience that can improve. It doesn't take a lot of time. The most important thing, like with anything, is consistency and we would love to help you with that journey so if you're locally here or in naples florida we offer this quarterly if you're interested in more information you can look online at our website we have our upcoming dates or send us an email and i'd be happy to help you dr Kaysen here with the drugless doctors